If you've never been here before, I might need to say that I'm right in the middle of building a bathroom and it's been a bit on a standstill for the last few days because I haven't been able to switch the blade on the tile cutter. Kind of annoying because obviously I, I really want to get the tiling done. In this episode, you get to see the little progress that I make. Okay, so Celebrating the little successes. I also get my chimney repaired and my fireplace installed. Hope you enjoy it. I did it! Interesting comparison. These are the same sizes and yeah, you can barely see it, but it's very little left of like a cutting edge on the old one. So that was time. Oh. to be able to fix something that I thought I wouldn't be able to fix. I often borrow tools. This is my dad's machine. And uh, more often than not, I return it broken, being like, uh, it doesn't work anymore. Thanks for lending it to me. And uh, this time it feels so good that I was able to fix it by myself. And uh, yeah, that I will be able to return it with a new blade eventually. I mean, I borrowed it for like, three years now, um, but one day I will return it. <laughs>
our music playing. Um, I've had this on for so long now. That was the loss of the tiling. Um, yeah, I've been really pushing through now. And um, yeah, this last bit was a bit tricky. I'll be really happy and excited in a while uh, when I've gotten some rest. The fireplace is getting installed today and uh, they uh, have just arrived. I'm not sure if they want to be on film. I'm not sure if I dare to ask them either. We'll see. Alright, so they have just left and the fireplace is installed and I'm really happy. I have the smoke channel in the left side of the chimney and I asked them if it was possible to center it on the entire chimney, which they could. Uh, I would say that they were really skilled. They made a really good job. So yeah, super happy. I just made a little spontaneous decision that I would uh, grout the um, wall tiles as well with the same grout. Um, that's not really what I planned. I planned to use um, a much lighter grout. Um, but I had so much left over from the floor that I didn't want to throw away. And it looked like quite a nice color. So here we go.
I find it really awkward to speak English in front of <laughs> because obviously it's not our uh, native uh, language but uh, I'm gonna do that anyway the chimney was proved so uh, there was just a minor thing that had to be done for it to be finally approved and that is uh, fixing the it's actually not visible now. It's uh, fixing the ladder, so it's actually stuck to the roof. And uh, grafting is done, really stoked about that. Now I can clean up everything that had to do with tiling. So I'm just gonna put most of it down in the basement, I think.
It's kind of annoying. I was just wiping down all the tiles earlier this morning when I noticed that um, there were stains that wouldn't go away on the tiles from the grout. And um, then I googled it and someone had gotten the advice that like, oh, there's nothing to do about it, uh, that can happen to uh, tiles of low quality and yeah, there's basically just gonna be stains. Huh. Yeah, but I noticed if I scrub it really hard, I, um, I can get rid of it. Although that's not what I was wishing to do today, to be scrubbing tiles. Um... But uh, I guess there isn't much to do. It doesn't look very nice with this, like, yeah, with these dark stains on it. I'm uh, out on a bit of a road trip uh, because of two reasons. I um, found an old toilet seat on Marketplace that I'm gonna pick up in a place called Lund. And Lund is not too far away from Malmö. So I decided to go all the way down to Malmö. They have like a big shop for reused building material. So now I'm here and I'm yeah, I'm almost there. So I'm starting with the reused building material shop and then I'm gonna go pick up the toilet. It will require some work, uh, sanding them down, but I think this could be great for, uh, for my build. This is hilarious. I can see the toilet from here. It's actually, it's right there. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was easy to find. I had made an arrangement with um, the people that is selling the toilet that they would just put it out in the carport and I would uh, pay them in advance. And uh, yeah, they put it out. So that's good news. It was funny to see it all the way driving, driving down the road. So yeah, now I'm just going to shove it in. I'm uh, back and about to carry everything in. I think it was a great day actually. I uh, got the toilet, which I'm gonna put under a tarp over here. And I also found some glass that I intend to put into uh, the door so I get some daylight into the toilet.
Oh, it seems like it seems like it's raining too much for this. So. It's really fun to get started on this project. Um, it's a little project within the project, but um, yeah, so this is going to be like a wash stand where I'll have my wash basin on. And the idea is to like sandwich these sides together. I will have like a small shelf at the bottom 